Alex, check this out. We're in Colombia right now, and we just spent 16,300 pesos. Uh, pesos colombiano. Pesos colombiano. Okay, we are in Colombia. Yes. And guess what we're doing right now, guys? We're walking around the mall. We're trying to find some fun things to do because we've been bored this whole time in Colombia. I'm not gonna lie. I'm very, very underwhelmed. I want to do some really cool, fun things. We go to the mall. We're just checking out the movies, and look what movie we see here. Amityville. This is about the Amityville Horror House, which is literally five minutes away from where I live. You guys know we made videos there, I think, once or twice. And I was actually talking to the girl at the front. I was like, hey, uh, yo vivo in Amityville. Aww. And she was looking at me like, okay, cool, I, I don't care. I'm just trying to do my job here. And I said it twice. I was like, yo vivo in Amityville. And we're in Colombia. We're in South America right now. And she was like, I don't care. Here, yeah. take your ticket. You Guys, 16,300 Colombian pesos is like $8. That's pretty crazy. It's crazy. So the movie's at 7.20 tonight. It's like three o'clock right now. I want to show you guys really quick where we're heading over to. This mall is crazy. That's the one thing about places I've seen in Mexico, malls I've seen in Colombia so far in South America. The malls are like these mega crazy amazing places. So I saw like a little Ferris wheel over there, but check this view out over here guys on these mountains over here. We tried to take a picture, but the view and the picture that we got wasn't that good. Um, so yeah, we got about uh, four hours before the movie starts So we're gonna try to just run around have some fun and do some crazy things So uh, sit back and enjoy the vlog. You know, we're in an Adidas store and the girl said that I'm allowed to play around this ball We're at this restaurant yesterday and Lionel Messi actually ate there. So I just made up the Lionel Messi challenge. Ready? Oh, you're terrible. I'm so sorry Lo siento mucho I did not mean to do that, I promise. We're about to get a haircut in the salon over here. It looks very nice, very fashionable. But then I thought to myself, if I was to get a haircut right now, the hair would be sinking down to my neck. Yeah, guys, there's a lot of dogs in this mall. I don't know, is that, Jeanette, that's not, we can't do that in North America, I don't think. Yeah, you could do that in Mexico? Yeah. You can have dogs? Guys, I'm not sure. Are we allowed to have dogs in our malls in North America? I know most of you guys are from the United States. So for you guys who are from the United States, comment and let me know. But I was going to get a haircut and then I realized that if I did, the hair would be all over my neck and I, I hate that feeling. And we're about to go see this movie in three hours. So if I had to walk around this mall with hair all over my neck, it's no bueno. No me gusta. So what I did, I scheduled an appointment with them in Spanish. Un cita means an appointment. So I said, <laughs> lo siento, mi novia y yo tenemos una cita for La Policula de Amityville. I said, we have an appointment for the movie Amityville. So the woman was like, oh, it's no problem. It's okay. Aww. And Jeanette was like, but oh. You're so cute with you ask and you Jeanette, speak in Spanish, so, so cute. Can we take a second to talk about the girl from the Adidas store? Okay. The fake, Je guys. Because it's, me. Yes, it's, not it's the culture. I'm not, I'm not joking. I'm not trying to like, I'm not, I'm not saying anything wrong. It's not a bad thing, but I swear like, Almost every other girl you see here has like fake butts. Yeah. It's crazy. Almost because he is a very good um, doctor for surgery. They have great doctors for surgeries, and I feel so embarrassed because all these girls keep looking at me, uh. and I'm with my girlfriend, and they're like, "Ooh, mm, this green ball, see?" <laughs> and I'm like, Ugh, "My girlfriend's right here, and she's gonna kill no, me." But uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna figure out something else to do. We're gonna have some fun. Let's go, guys. I was walking around the mall. And I ran into a homie. His name's David. He's from Colombia. Just subscribed a couple of days ago. Hello. Nice to meet you, bro. Thank you. Take it easy. Okay. Five hours later. Yo, guys. We just saw the movie Amityville, oh and it's crazy because we're in we're in South America right now, and they got the movie Amityville playing, and the entire time, any time there was a jump scare, even if it was so obvious, Yannette goes. Everybody, so everybody in the movie theater just starts laughing. Guys, I was getting embarrassed. Yeah, I thought. I was, <laughs> it had to happen like, there was probably five jump scares in the span of like 15 minutes. Every single jump scare. Ha! I know! I can't, I can't. Jeanette, give, give me a high no. Give me a I no. know, dog. I know! <laughs> um, but guys, it's, it's really late at night right now. And we gotta be up early tomorrow. We have a pretty special day. Uh, I think I have to go back to the dentist because there's some work that needs to get done on my teeth. <laughs> well, Santiago. Santiago. We have to go see Santiago again tomorrow morning, super early, and it's late at night right now. So, yeah. home mall is shutting down. Hopefully our taxi is gonna be waiting for us because our phones are dead. I know. Which is not a good thing. I know, we're in a foreign country <sighs> and our phones are dead. That's great. So, we're gonna go meet up at the taxi stand, get a lift back home, and then tomorrow, will be another new day. 
So let's do it. The next morning. Good morning, everybody. It's now the next day, and we're gonna go head back to the dentist. <laughs> this feels like deja vu. <laughs> Buenos dias. Buenos dias. Buenos dias. Buenos dias, mi amor. Buenos dias. Listo. Tú estás nervioso. ¿Cómo te sientes? ¿Estás miedo? No, estás miedo. Estás nervioso. Eventually. Yay. Hey, how you doing? Are you doing fine? Yeah. Are you scared? Of course not. Oh yeah. <laughs> never scared. Face sensor is never scared. Oh. Nope. <laughs> All right, guys, we just filled up a big cavity. Was that a big cavity over here? It was it big? Yes. It was big? It was big. Yeah. Yeah. It was a big one, guys. We got it fixed. We're good yeah. now. Yeah. We're all Perfect. set. Ah. Uh, oh. Muy bien. Perfecto. No more black. Muchas gracias, Santiago. Oh. Oh. <laughs> All right, guys, right now we're at a random stop that we just found over here in Colombia, and we're going to have a Platina Maduro. So basically... Platano Maduro. A what? Platano Maduro. Basically, guys, what a Platano Maduro is. Maduro, I'm sorry, guys. My, my, he's laughing at me. My, my pronunciation is terrible, guys. This is basically kind of like a, a sweet banana, and there's a bunch of different toppings we could put on it. So, um, I don't know what I'm going to get on it. I'm just going to ask her to put whatever she recommends on it. And um, we're going to try this thing and see how it tastes. Yo quiero uno con todo y uno con nada. Or que, ¿cuál es tu recomendación? Con todo. Con todo. Ok, bueno. ¿Tú quieres uno? Sí. ¿Con todo? Sí. Ok, entonces dos con todo. Muy bien. ¿Y uh, cuántos pesos? Con todo. Ay, sí. Cuatro mil. Cuatro mil? Four thousand for two bananas? <laughs> So we're preparing the food right now. Basically what they do is they take the banana, I guess it's a sweet banana, they crush it up, they put butter on it, soften it up, then they put some cheese on it, then we put some more cheese on it, and then a bunch of different sauces, and then it's ready to eat. Gracias. All right, guys, we have our Platano Maduros, right? Is that what it is? Platano Maduro. Mature bananas, that's what we have right here. Uh, we're gonna dig in right now and try this for the first time. You ready? Okay, fine. Let's do it. Wait, 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 we gotta choose. Oh man, look at all that right there, guys. Let's go. You ready, Annette? Yeah. Cheers. Why oh, you don't like that? No le gusto. No le gusto. No, I'm sorry. Oh my goodness, I need water. No, it's not I'm so gusto. sorry. Lo siento mucho. Y a usted, le gusto. Está bueno. You like that? It's Platano Maduro. Platano Maduro. Oh my goodness, I'm so embarrassed right now, guys. Que pena. Que pena. No problem. Oh man, I'm so picky. I'm so sorry, guys. I definitely like it. You like it though? Yeah, it's very good. What do you think? It's very sweet. Usted no la había probado nunca. No, es la primera vez. Yeah, it's my first time ever eating this. Nunca habíamos venido a Colombia, es la primera vez. First time in Colombia, guys. First time eating a Platano Maduro. It's very sweet. It has a little bit of like a, a mozzarella cheese and a Parmesan cheese, but then like a bunch of different toppings on it. I don't know, if you guys have ever tried this, Put it in the comments down below and let me know. All right, guys, let's go back to the hotel. All right, guys, we're back in the hotel room now, and uh, that's where I feel like we've been this entire time in Colombia. We got Yannette sitting over here. Yannette Garcia, are you are you making a video for YouTube? Yes. And where can we find that video? <gasps> I am Yannette Garcia. Oh. Subscribe. Really? Yeah. Okay, I'll do that. Thank you. Yeah. I love you. I love you too. Uh, also, guys, um, on a serious note, though, I want to give a huge shout-out to Santiago. If you guys want to follow him on his Instagram, it'll be right here on the screen. He's helping me out a lot. He fixed the cavity that's in my tooth in the bottom over here. Uh, I think it focused. I don't know if you guys can see that, but... He fixed the cavity in my tooth. He gave me like a free whitening, a free cleaning. But like I just said, Santiago has been such a big help for Yannette and I. Helping me out with my teeth, get my teeth a little bit more white, fixing my cavities, helping Yannette out with her smile. Anything you want to say about Santiago? Es un bueno hombre. The best doctor. We travel together, Doc and me, to Colombia for visit this doctor because really, really the best doctor. Uh, if you need something in your teeth, 
come back. But that's where I'm gonna end today's video. Again, I wanna give you guys a huge, huge thank you for all of the support recently on my YouTube channel. Subscribe if you guys are new. For all the homies I'm in in Colombia, you guys are awesome. I love this place. And yeah, that's where I'm gonna end it today. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all have a great day. It's been your boy Doug Sensormarin, and I'm out, guys. Peace.